Hello everyone, welcome to Tony Talks. Hey, to all our beautiful subscribers, we say thank you so much for staying with us and uh, you are new here we are happy you find us please don't forget to like subscribe and uh, hit the notification bell so you will be notified for more upcoming videos in the comment section please no derogatory comments thank you all for watching till i will see you in my next video stay safe stay blessed i love you all bye you now marry her it is the way she knows how to do things. But she corny. She was not taught how to be neat. She doesn't know what to be neat, what it is to be neat. In fact, oh lazy funre. As a man, the best you can do if you have such a woman, because these are angles where men nag. One of the angles. If you have such women. Just like I cited it in a man too. If you have such women, the third time, you might need to start doing some things by yourself. That way, you are passing a message instead of fighting all the time. If she sees you trying to tidy up things and you are letting her know how much you appreciate neatness, Eric Samuel, no, not that now you are talking a true. I balance my talk. I go for both man and woman. That's the way I talk. You, should, you are the one that should be patient and listen to me. I am not engine. I can't carry everything and talk at the same time. Okay? I can't carry everything and talk about about and talk everything at the same time. I have to pick it one by one. Because that is another thing. That drives men outside. When a man will meet a woman, Tofe Obiri, that is supposed to be homemaker, Towa Wale, so does not know what to do and all that and all that. By the time the man will go and match and meet another woman, Tonta Sanson, Oji Dondo Koju Ewa Obiri. You know me, I will tell the truth. Either you like me or not. As ya lele, ya wonu leto loko. Oh, loko gon go do mata son son all the time. For your own good. Ki wo gon wore, ki nu e dun. Either you have a man or you don't. Kama iti wa so po loko le, o ni a woman le, pa shi wo bo wo bo birin. And you think that's your man. The day you will jam a woman, we clean. We clean. We be saying that the woman we clean, even throw him to the man. You think he will not grab it. Ah, he <laughs> will grab it all. So when that man he starts nagging, ask questions. The same way when a woman is nagging too, I will encourage you ask question. Kilo fabu bo nkoton so yigon gon. Fieldiness, uncleanliness, not doing the right thing, causes nagging. But, like I said earlier, a full-grown adult that has been formed before you marry them, some of their characters, you are not the one to change it. You can talk to them, communicate with them. Some men don't know how to communicate to their wives. That is why they nag, and things will now, became wo and now become worse. If you have a wife that was not well-trained in putting house together, in being neat, there is a way you can go about it instead of nagging her. Try and talk to her. Communicate with her. If need be, stylishly go on a visit to your friend, one of your friends that the wife is very neat. Ujwati. And encourage her, not by scolding her. Not by calling our names. Calling our names will make things worse. Like I said about men too. I said in the process of nagging, you will call your husband a name the man will never forgive you for. The man will forever hold against you. 
if you in the process of complaining, which is nagging, persistent nagging, you will unconsciously call her names. And that name, she will hold it in her heart against you forever. Instead of that, there is a way you can encourage her. And instead, there are some things that we nag for that we are not supposed to nag for. Instead, is encouragement by putting in your own efforts. Sometimes, if the woman is the type that doesn't know how to, you know, put things together, either dress well or do the house well, if you know how to do it, tell her lovingly, ah, babe, tomorrow, which is going to be Saturday, we are not going out, we are not going to anywhere. I want us to do some changes in the house. In other words, indirectly, you have passed a message to her. You have passed the message to her that the household needs to be changed. And you wake up in the morning as a man. It's a job. But because she doesn't, you have tried to change her to do it. You now say, you carry mop. You say she should carry broom. You carry the broom. I will carry the mop. The same way we encourage our children to attain greatness. If we start seeing our partners like our children sometimes, life will be more peaceful and more better. When we see a weakness in our child, do we throw them away? Do we start calling? Okay, some parents do that and it will affect that child's self-esteem for life. You don't go calling them names. And if you have done that, apologize to your children for calling them names. That you don't mean it that way. What we do is to encourage them. Oh yeah, you take broom. You take, I will take the mop. As you are sweeping, I am mopping. Same work. As you are sweeping, I am mopping. I mop finish. I carry dust. I say, oh yeah, let's rearrange the cupboard. Let's rearrange the plates. Let's put this one here. Let's put this one there. It is like two uh, people coming from two different backgrounds. It is what has happened to many of us. And inside marriage, there will now be clash of conflicts. Clash of uh, upbringing. You know, so yeah, you encourage her by doing that. That way she knows that is where you want it. And you tell her, you have passed a message that the way she was doing it, you don't like it. She knows that is what you want. It might be tough for her to adjust very well, but gradually, gradually, and she may not fully adjust fully as you want it. You have to, you, you have to be the one to now balance it. The same way, that we can never, ever have it perfect. Every one of us have one flaw or one um, weakness. That weakness, the other party should turn into strength by using his own kidney or using our own something to, 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 to balance it. So that woman, I always encourage women, there is no basis, there is no excuse for a woman, even for her own self, her health, there is no basis for any woman to be dirty. Tori and Fanyare go health wise because of the kind of, of the kind of body we have. The kind of makeup, tarawaje, to ban dirty, umba utim banu liare inua inua egonje to ni mo, asu biri, talk less of. Even your home, if you are dirty in the home. Like I always say, you don't have to be rich. I have lived in a one room apartment with my first husband. Teba de with my late husband. Teba de wo ilenye. You you won't believe it's a one room bedroom the way I arrange it and put things together there. Even if it's one room you are living, room and parlor, you don't have to. Sherry, our problem is a man choke calling it furnitures. We choke ourselves with panty, dirty, too much load, so that they will say we have plenty load. My calling is family therapist. 
Okay, well, I don't hear you. <laughs> you know, your 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 home. Putting too many things in the house does not mean you are rich. Packing too much load, shine shine thing. Don't choke your home. In the process, you are dirty. And your children. Do you, let me tell you one thing. This is a this is something my own experience. When my children were back in Nigeria, they have a lot of friends. I find out that those children prefer to come to my house than when my children go to play with them, they will say, Let's go to your house. They are always coming, filling my own home. Why? When they come, there is not for everybody to chop. When they come, they have space to play. You know, in the house, in the living room. And I will tell you, in that living room, I have my furniture, broken things. I mean, breakable things, not on the board of four. Because my children, that is the way I brought them up. They are all these things, though, don't go near them. I always train my children from age two. When they start crawling, what I did when they were young was to have something like a toy box for them. Instead that toy box, that is where they play. And when they have to come out, they know some places they are not supposed to go. So I put furniture and breakable things, even though I know better that I would rather not do that. Now that I know better that those things are dangerous where you have children, especially toddlers. But luckily enough, they never broke, but their friends came to broke, break some of them. But I tell you, because of the space, they would rather come. Because I don't choke home with furniture. I love spaces. And I love big living room. Big living room, big um, bedroom. But we, somebody, you are staying in a room of parlor apartments. You choke that apartment with too much furniture. So the people can see you as a rich person. No. In the process, Panty, Lenko Jo. Your children cannot even have space to play. Mama she said, Besek, back on control learning. All because you want to show that you have money. You choke the house with furniture. Oh, Billy Lodi and Tole Ju, but some men are good at it. Top of Kunimi, but Tole Funiba. Ah, respect. I have a friend. Picture living room, eh? A mu binitu mutu envy anyway. Ah, I love this picture. I love the I love the way you set up this place. Oh kuni. Very beautiful. Not expensive things, oh. Very unique things. Oh, there are to ah kuni lot to lebai. But some women. Ah, obini me a shele a miti moje obini gon. You can let stand it. Oh, be me. You go to their houses. Oh, if you cop one mummy to buy big cop of a mummy buy own way on the mama bo. So, you rain your bay, yeah. If you are that kind of a woman where your husband will come from work, of a gem, oh, big cop, cop on mummy around, and you want the man to be to be staying steadily. The day that man will go to a place where don't set it that that to repel needs to real being yeah, and it's not about mobile will be a couple of people who will it's not about that. Who will be a couple of clean or do do clean as in ebony black, ebony black. So you shall want to make a carry what on my land will move simple and you know, yeah, no simple and you are. He only called your last song, but to spell it on Jade. Hmm. I'm a shebine. Ah. Kohile be the quick perfume wololo. The guy cannot ask quick perfume wololo, but don't go quick. Ah. She will be really lazy. She will be really lazy. Ah. Bully motiri no. I have had a man say bully motiri no. Padio biniti mo besile. I have had a man say it. Only anti tebari no let me. Mu den fun lo wo. Mu ti complain, complain, ko change. I said, okay, if you have complained, help her. She said, it's my said he's doing it. Ko mu to ti lo kwa da, bo mu to ti dan konru. 
Como upon to le she. So those are the things. But instead of some men nagging, the way we women nag, they will not nag. The next thing is they go outside. The next thing is they go outside. That thing you are lacking, that thing you refuse to do, where they will come to the home, and the home does not look peaceful, the home does not look beautiful. They are finding it somewhere else, and they are, they are, they are, they are, they are, they are converting, converting that place. Ah, how I wish this is my home. Ah, I wish this is the wife I marry. How I wish I can marry this woman. Ah, I wish I can divorce. And those are one of the things that, before you know it, in Ule, no more love. Because the man already is seen. He's seen why he shouldn't have married you. It's reality. At that moment, he's seen many reasons why he made a mistake to have chosen you as a wife. And he will be saying, if not for the children, if not for the children, and before you know it, what used to be beautiful among between you is no more beautiful. Because he's just doing it to relieve his body, not doing it for satisfaction anymore. And all he wants to do is to carry you on bed and do quicky, 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 quicky. He biggie, no He will not give him your, his best into the thing again. Because why? He has somewhere now. And there will always be somebody like that available. There will always be somebody outside. That is monitor, more well arranged, more peaceful. Where you are nagging, somebody is giving him peace somewhere else. And the same thing goes for a man. Oh, being sorry, want him quick, dear, dear. Me, there is a poly quick, quick, but want him call and want. You self see it on social media these days. Where women will tell themselves, Do me, I do you, God, no go vex. When I see things like that, I'm like, Ah, and your more, you buy a get on. Eba ye ye, do me I do you. Talk we ba do yon, we no lo do yon. Hey, ashe ko, wala de. And when somebody like us talk, they will say I'm old school, I should keep quiet. Do me I do you. No ri okodi do. Ah. Ose ko ton jebe yon. Fo bi yon yon, but eba le efe she. Me I will not stop anybody from doing it. But trust me, e te lo muwa fo bi yon yon. I do ti, i ti ju. Ta won mo e o gbodo gbo Awon mo to bi o gbodo gbo ko seru e I pe wa we dear father Olorun do elomi your children will not clap for you In ko ta ba ma se ti a ni le gbori wa soke I'm always saying that thing anytime I beat my chest When it comes to cheating you can never meet me there One man at a time only Ale waja ko ma sin kokon mo ma fa tegun le ma ri pe ko sin kokon mo Yes ma ti ri pe yes ele yo ko sin kokon be mo Oni kaluku tu la tegun ti fe sile Kin to se mi Mi ni so pe mi oni se mi ma se mi but ti once we are still together to yin gun mi e wo temi ni kokunrin meji gun mi po Is abomination in my own life I don't know about you In my own life o oh, is abomination Why inside one my house we are not divorced. Kolong wo shemo. Kole me jade. A jon son a jon ji. Ma wani to loro do konta. A mi loro banyon son ta. E mi na wakbe bagi. O kone to do mi. Ti mo lo bako do mi nye. Show value mi. Show kami kon. Show fe fe mi ni. Ti wo bwe ba daru. Show magba mi. Those are the things you should ask yourself. Before you start taking some crazy advices. From women. From my own, I, I see such nonsense advice these days, and I'm like, she be tired as a people, lele. Talk about she won't know she. Do me, I do you. Need be marriage. <laughs> okay, one you copy in that tony, copy in that tony. How I went into my low millennial, say, Jura Molo. It's very simple. So if you're a woman, you are watching me, especially if you are young. Oh, one little call. Some friends are telling you, do me, I do you, God, no go vex. I pity you. You better don't try it with them. They have been shed, Danny won. 
don't ever take that advice from anybody that because your mind is doing you to go and do you are still married to somebody you are somebody's wife except you are divorced from that man if you are not yet divorced from that man you cannot say do me i do you and i say she be I, eh, he has done it several times i only do it once eh, eh. It's, not, it's not the same oh. it's never the same it's never the same and for men some men, I learned some men, they take this thing, they punish their wives. If you are doing that, me, I will not advise any woman to do, uh, to reciprocate. I cannot shame me. Do me, I do, you are alone, far bossy. He raw, apart from Mara, is emotional damage for a woman, emotionally damaged. If they are really thinking about this thing, okay. Let's look at the scenario. I should be going very soon, 15 minutes. Let's look at the scenario now. You are married to a man, right? Another man. Okay, because your man is now, he has a girlfriend that you get to know. Somebody now advise you. Or you cry to somebody's neck. Uh, my husband is this. My husband is that. That person now, a man that you are talking to, now embrace you. And I want to believe very likely the man is married too, right? Because mostly, according to what I am hearing, it be like say now married men versus married women, they do themselves most times now. What is raining now? The man go get wife. The man wait and they date, save they get wife. So two get four. They will now meet. In the process. Number one, the man will not, never, if the marriage should break, your marriage should break because of that. Your, your, your husband now drive, you say you don't want to do it again if he gets to know. Number one, that man where they go meet, he will never leave his wife. His own wife will still embrace him. So who is going to lose? All you have seen a man who left his wife because girlfriend, uh, husband catch, girl, catch in wife with him. He can't say because of that, divorcing wife, come marry the girlfriend, live in one family. If it happened, maybe one in out of one million. So you can see that the probability and possibility is very, very low. So at the end of the day, your husband catch you, can't leave, you say you no do again. Now, the man where in wife, where you the dating wife, I mean husband, himself don't know. Before you know it, the man will say, my wife don't know, say something to go on between us. It'll be like, say, we go, we go slow down. You will now end up being the one that will be carrying phone. Before you know it, now that man will be your boyfriend, somebody husband, you go begin course. As if to say, now you cause your problem. Now that one you will begin cause. Before you know it, you can even carry your phone and begin to fight the wife. Before you know it, you will be doing things irrationally. Because at that stage, you won't be able to pieces it together. You see, this thing, all these things we are talking about, like I always tell people, is five minutes enjoyment. So you, because of five minutes enjoyment, destroy what you have built over the years. The same thing goes for men too. Where do they take sense? Waka. Five minutes enjoyment. Because I've had men say, in your colo da marriage and woru, and we mean that if you are one, one, she go, you are one, we know, oh lo, kilo shake, you are wet, oh lo. Five minutes enjoyment. Where you know, take your head, you do. And the same person where you they go meet for that outside, he get another boyfriend. Because the most uh, women for outside, especially single mothers, eh, where still get more picking, where go go school and all that, they are not into, and they don't really have much on their own. They are not into relationship for love. Oh. No deceive yourself, and I will not blame them. They are not into any relationship with any man. 
for love. They are into their relationship so that their load can be easy to carry. And most of them, financially. And if it is for financial gain, except you are very rich, you can do enough. That is when they will keep only you. But if you, are, if you can't do enough, they still have to struggle. They still have to struggle. When they see another man, they go join them to you. You can't go because of that, destroy your home. At the end of the day, you can't find out, say, that your girlfriend, though, will make your marriage destroy. No be only you there for a hand. See, ever bear. Tell them about what family we could get all the ones on all here. You know, let out him. Tell the people all only control because some of you do that thing. Eh, ballet for bearing so that you can be controlling that woman. So you think by paying the house rent, she will not be able to carry another man there. Many of you are abroad. The fair was seen in Nigeria, Benny. Then the new year was seen abroad. Till you go to abroad in your home. If my fair girlfriend, if I answer any girlfriend, if I'm in Nigeria, am I being in your country? Shame you, sister, or you? Shake him all up. Keep my best speaker, you. Make I the worker go. I'm waiting for your answer. Make I the worker go. And your business should I continue? Man, should I stop? Eh? I should go on. I love my men. I love the guys on this page. Thank you. I don't want to offend you. <laughs> Most of you men, you are in abroad here. Yeah. You have wife here. Yeah. Instead of you to have young things. But because only she could share the majority. Yeah. You now, thank you everybody. <laughs> YouTube say I should continue too. You now have girlfriend in Nigeria. Eh? Nigeria low low. Told you a auto. I should change topic. She said I want to share with somebody. Kunle she I will not change. She all eyes on you. Anytime I'm doing this kind of show. I will not change. I won't change. Anyways. You now have girlfriend in Nigeria. All because once in a while. You they talk to her on video call. She they open her punani. She they open her voice. You they see her. You they take that one to the Damira. You now think you are paying the rent. You are in charge. You think you are in charge. Abby, for somebody we get picking for hand, we want to train our children. I don't blame her because you say if you get wife, now you go to carry you rich day. So I'm not blaming the woman at all. I don't wear their shoes, so I'm not going to blame them. Anybody will wear their shoes. Even when I date single mother, I know what it is to pay my children's school fees. Me, I no collect from man. No, I no even get luck of man giving me money. I no collect from man. I may struggle to pay my children's school fees. And I don't need to pay house rent. Now our house, let me get house. I even get where they collect rent. So my own case is very different. So the woman, you can rent house for her so that you can be in charge. You can be in control. You can't because of that. You can't destroy your house. Oh, nobody. I don't go stop. You can't because of that destroy your home. Now you get the fault. You cannot blame it on the woman, on the woman in Nigeria. I'm using it as an example. Where you the parent for? You can't blame it, saying that she destroy your home. As you can't mess up, you can't go back home. You think say you get wife, you can't see say whether she don't get belly for another man, or you meet another man inside the house. Before uncle, now question I ask you. Before uncle, because some of you men think, especially these days, that dollar is a good money when you change it to naira. Some of you think with your money, you can get any woman, you can just do what you like. The women are wiser, especially in younger generation. They are using you guys very well, and I like it. As now, no one sit down for one place. Now they cause trouble up and down. Some of you will give them belay, you know, go collect them. 
Some of you get them pregnant. You will say, no, you get belly. Because of the wife, where you get for house. You know, say you get wife for house. You they go mess up for outside. Men with their head correct. They know as then they do. I know of a guy. That guy, if they told me, say, men, they day very tall. This guy is 6.5. Very handsome. Very, very, if this guy dress finish for you, what could just be on possible? If he dress finish, oh my god, oh my duro, oh my duro, oh my shake book, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my fine rich, one picking, you know, get for outside. You know what they do? And if he get girlfriend, they tell them, say, I get wife for house, no get belle for me, oh. He they always ring gang. To women here, to ba lo nyu wa bi mo wa bi lati fun any companionship. He go tell the woman that I go give you the companionship needed. I will make myself available. Call me anytime you need me now. Call me that satisfaction guarantee. Call me anytime you need me. I don't know if I sang the well the song well. You know that song. Call me. Now, so the guy they play in game. Respect. He tells women that he's dating. No picking. He tells them, no picking, no. My wife is there. You get better, you take care of them. But if you need me, call me. And the day you make a mistake to call me when I day house, now that day relationship go end. He do it on his own terms. Because the lady that wants to date a married man, she know he has a woman. And she respect that. And if you now mess up, you go get belay for him. And he refuse to collect it. You cost it. Once they, that is why that kind of man, I respect them. He has stated it clearly. Clean way. But because some women, they just like trouble for their life. Because if you don't like trouble for your life, a man is married. I always tell women, if a man decides, he said he wants to marry, he, he said he loves you, and he has a wife or house, and he's deceiving you, to test him, tell him to go and do a dano. Tell him you go stay for your very something. Now that day, you go no say, the man is only there to play. Or you test him. Thank you, Ada. Is How are you, sweetie? Or you tell him you are pregnant. You go see, say that that day, the relationship will go sour. Most of our ladies, most of them that end up being a single mother to men that cannot accept their children today, especially those married men, are men, are, are ladies who do not know, know how to play the game. And they feel once a man come, they can wriggle their way and marry that man by fire by force. No. If a man doesn't want to, a man has to be the one to decide he wants to marry you. If he doesn't want to marry you, he doesn't want to marry you. If he doesn't want a second woman, he doesn't want. If you now squeeze your head to be a second wife, which is second wife, I they see. Especially if the man is still in love with the first wife. You will not say, Shakaki no be leda. If a man is still in love with the first, with the wife at all, and you wriggle your way to be a second wife. It's always ending in tears, blood, and water. You wake up, she man, you go cry, tired. You go go into depression. Sadness, go to sleep and wake up with you. Because it, you know he's married. And he never told you he wants to marry you. It was only how to play. If you want to play, play. And play by the rules. You don't play by the rules, you find yourself. Men want to call in and talk. Hey, come call in. I don't want to fair play. Oh, yeah, call in. Hey, you get long time. Oh, yeah, my phone, you need 30 minutes more. If you want to call, she'll fair call in. That's not fair call in. Thank you. Sorry, tears and blood. Uluwa Sheung. There are rules to play by in everything. You don't play by the rules. Ekunlo majasi. Atu wadiv bae from eni to obatu fe. 
Ah, in your code, this is not the number you me. Let me delete it. Plus one, two four zero four two four Let me give like two, three people to talk. You don't play by the rules. You got to do low marry. A man that is in love with a wife. What you are wearing, one jar. Come on, you have problem. Who just wants to play? You now get yourself hook on his neck. And he was like, okay, my lord, I know it. Oh, lord, I know it. And you think, by the time Toba, my lord, I know it. Your me is the first caller. <laughs> by the time Toba, my lord, I know it. He do know it, call off it, I know it. It was not his choice to marry you. When a man makes his choice on their home, that is when you enjoy them. Sorry, we have diverged on the topic. It's all okay. It's Friday. A man making his own decision to say, I want to marry you is the best. Not you wrangling um, your way. Thank you, Yomi. Let me pin the number. The number is pin if you want to call. Not you wriggling your way into his, into his family. He has to be the one to have a reason to marry a second wife. The man has to have a reason on his own. That is when you can get the best of him. That is when you can get, not even the best. At least something. I won't say the best. Remember he has a family, family before you. He has grown up children before he met you. And those children, like I said, he has reasons. Some men have actually have reason to marry another wife. For their self, for their future, for their happiness. For their peace because marriage don't want no is nothing to write more write home about anymore. The children want to turn against it. Such men have every reason, and I will say every backing to have another good life and start another life. Koto late. Yes. Who are your first wife? Lay my like a lay you and your brita one in lay and my like it, but it's just the truth. You know why. We women, we have our children to fall back on. Lojoale. Who does this man have to fall back on? Lojoale. Hello, me. The children have been turned against the man. Hello, me. The man. Itorio wants. Iya wenja. Iya wogo. Yako sumo umo. And you know why? You know what? Men are not. They are not created to stay alone. They are not. A woman can stay alone for long. A man cannot. Some can, but very few. Very, very few. Some here in abroad, they have made their plans. On to share plans, on to share everything. Sile. Ko si ya wo, ko omo o sinto si won. On de gbe gbe aye won, peacefully. But not all of them. And that is why you find that some of them will go back to Nigeria to go. Out. Some don't have the plan to go back, but somebody be law, they will relocate, but they will start planning to relocate back home. So some have reasons to actually do to get another wife. And nobody should tell them not to. Yeah, for medical reasons too. Prostate cancer, not one day. The same way. A woman too. Oh, bring on the kinetic and soy to the five broad. She be lady come. Mo come on, mama post the kinetic lady nye. One no cut to the five broad. Let me jump into it. A one gospel gospel singer. But the equa on family any cancer ni. Only the five broad to the cancer sini no. Be ta yoka. And I'm very sure. We are going to go. Hello, my yoro ko na lolo temi. We are going to go to look by Jesus. A lot of our own Lord Church in here. That is the reason you find them. Sherry Kinney, Jerry is in here. I want to know if I brought you. Look, Jumbe. That Jerry is a program. I want to know if I brought you. No, Paul Jumbe. Don't want miracle. Take it or leave it. 
Yeah, yeah, what you are is very important for a man. Very, very important. So, Binity of Afeki, I won't fail your woman. Or come, fail your woman to your joy, Koshe normal. Oh, what very important. And that is why a man should look out for himself. Make money. Legitimately, you come out of say one. Make money legitimately to your joy. Oh, we alone must say there. Talk on your bad new woe. Ti o kon ba pe ti to ba fe fe omo 30 years a fe Yes coming Good morning son Oh you are back Good afternoon Ba o ni se Na o ju e ko se stress le ni Okay you don't look stressed I'm almost done mumbo You going out na Okay Oh, but it's about taking a walk on fair woe me. Because no matter how, you will have to just see. No matter how old a man is, no matter how old, he still needs somebody. No matter how old we are as a woman, we need somebody. Our children are there for, for us. Who is going to be there for that man? And no matter how old a woman is, this is what I wanted to say. A woman will always be jealous. No matter how old a woman is, she will still be jealous. So if you don't want that man to go and marry another woman, a she normal. And you know what? Children of these days, especially Awomokon, not all of them, but most of them, even as a mother, don't think they will be carrying you as handbag up and down with them. Don't think, especially in abroad, some of you know what I'm saying. In abroad, your children are not going to carry you as a handbag everywhere. You will stay on your own. They will stay on their own. So, we both need each other. For Joa Leno. So, for a man, Emma uh, Bamowi, you can't fault them too much. We look for our, out for ourselves by taking care of our children as women. Making sure. And that is why I always tell men too. The beauty, most beautiful thing for a man and a woman is for them to be there to old age with their children. Loving both of them together. Honestly, it's the most beautiful thing anybody can wish for. But not everybody have that luck. Many, it's not going to be like that anymore. They have to start afresh. They have to start anew. So, for a man, if you know things are fall, falling apart, there's nothing stopping you. The most important thing is make sure you have money. Money is important and important ah, for a man. With that money, if you are 80 years old, there will still be a woman with good health, with nothing doing you. There is somebody somewhere, a woman that will marry you. I will be ready to. If Nendu Woko, go and look at Nendu Woko. He's not even looking older anymore. Eh? He's not looking older anymore. And Nendu Woko is about 60 something. I'll be old enough. How old is Regina? So, eh, with money, a woman has the children to fall back on. Your money will rescue you in old age as a man. So, let me go now. Thank you, everyone. I think at this stage I've really tried for today. Um, please don't nag as a man. Don't nag as a woman. Some of you men, now you're nagging, break your marriage. Some of you men. And some of you women, now nagging, break your marriage. And some of you, nagging is about to break your marriage. You nagging is not about your husband. You nagging is not about your wife. It's about who you are. It's about you that you know how to do cho 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 You see me, somebody very close to me that knows me one on one. He tells me, he say, when people that are close to him that watches my video, when they tell him, say, ah, I do need bono, he say, I do need wo. As you see, she can't talk much, yo. You see me talking on social media. I think there is a spirit behind this social media that makes you talk, 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 talk. Outside the social media, I am not that, I talk, oh. But I'm not that you that uh, aggressive. That uh, I don't know how to put it. That you think ah this woman is fire. No, 
outside the social media, I'm a different person entirely, you know, especially when it comes to relating with my man. I'm something, somebody, I'm different. So, all right, let me go. Oh, oh, talong pe. Aburo, you ever contribute to me? All right, I've never called before. Because of missing number three is here, number one and number two. So, okay. Number one and number two did not call. Talo, you can call the number one. If I have their number, I will call. Is number one. I will call him, I have his number. <laughs> I have his number. <laughs> hey, thank you, no. <clears throat> I just want to encourage you. I'm a very shy person when it comes to talking. I'm not a talking <laughs> public talking person but you but talk you know. talk very well in the outside public now yes but i don't like public talk would you want to see me <laughs> and you'll find out that some of us that talk on social media outside social media we are shy <laughs> so you can you see it uh, it's when i'm with you one on one i talk but not uh publicly publicly okay yeah, <laughs> so I just want to encourage you, Auntie. Thank you so much. This is my first time of calling into your show. I've never thought it before. That's Remy Oduala. <laughs> That's Remy Oduala talking. So I will call your me now. <laughs> your fish number one and the uh, Ogua is number two. Well, I don't have Alex number. I have your miss number. <laughs> because they kept uh, dropping. Uh, Saying that that you are saying too much. She or I won't so. Yeah. Oh, very so or Kimata she didn't want. They don't like me see the revealing their secrets. I want to know them, Jamie see you. But they are not going to know my Jamie see what goes cope with you. Eh? They are learning from this. I know. We are all both learning, especially with the grown ups. You know, we are learning, we are seeing one or two of our mistakes and we are working on it and we are trying to build better relationship in future and uh, so i don't know why they are ask, they're asking you the time of you should go um it, they should listen so that they can also um how am i gonna say um the younger ones yes the younger ones coming behind them behind us should learn from it yeah.